British Exploring Society is a world-class youth development charity with a unique heritage founded on the belief that challenging experiences can transform lives. We empower and equip young people with the courage, skills, resilience and determination to make the most of their future. And our vision is for all young people to be able to contribute confidently in the world. We want equal access to challenging learning and adventure in the wilderness as an unbeatable preparation for adult life. British Exploring Society was founded in 1932 by Surgeon Commander George Murray Levitt, a member of Captain Scott's final Arctic expedition. It enabled me to have a life-changing experience. I then set up my own initiative with City Girl Nature, which is now a way to give back to my community for my love and passion for the outdoors. We take young people in small self-contained groups to experience adventure, personal development and to acquire knowledge in wild and remote locations. And while lots has changed, fundamentally uh, the model that George Mary Levick established in 1932 remains the same. So we've had nearly a hundred years to perfect and professionalise this approach and it works. On each programme, young explorers meet other young people from different backgrounds and are introduced to new perspectives. By working together as a team to overcome the challenges of living in the outdoors, young explorers have the chance to support each other whilst learning to appreciate their own skills and strengths. Young people that want to learn more about what it's like to be an explorer can join in with online World Stand Adventures. These interactive Zoom sessions teach you outdoor survival skills, give you helpful tips on kit and equipment, and offer science projects to help young people explore the wilderness where they stand. None of our expeditions have a set itinerary. We work to provide young explorers with the skills, confidence and agency to shape their own journeys. It's all about positive risk taking, increasing personal responsibility and overcoming challenges as individuals and as a team. During an expedition, young explorers enjoy scientific study and research. They take part in creative media projects to document their experiences. These projects are led by volunteer leaders who support young people throughout the expedition and act as positive and inspiring role models for young people. The Royal Society fundraises to support young people to go on an expedition, to pay for the programmes. We get that funding from donors, trusts and local organisations. The reason young people fundraise is threefold. Number one, to build their resilience. Number two, to make them appreciate the whole process. And number three, to get them to commit to being part of an expedition. British Exploring Society also establishes the skills and support a young person will need to feel prepared to take part in an expedition. This means that it doesn't matter if it's their first time camping in the wilderness or their first adventure away from home, they'll be given training in preparation. Our young explorers are accompanied on expedition by some of our highly skilled leaders. They provide our young explorers with the individual support and the rich learning opportunities and illuminating perspectives on paths through life that allow them to get as much as they possibly can out of their expeditionary experience with us. And they do this while volunteering hundreds of hours to support our programmes. After expedition, British Exploring Society's emphasis on community continues to be fostered. All who participate on an expedition with a sufficient degree of engagement and commitment are awarded membership to our global network which spans generations. We are also lucky to have a great deal of support from other people in our community, from fellows and funders to advisors and archivists. Through exploration, this allows British Exploring Society to deliver exceptional learning with life-defining impacts to an increasing number and diversity of young people.